All right, so what is going on today, YouTube? We're going to go back in with one more duel of the Lair of Darkness deck. Not liking it. Not liking it, man. Not liking it. Um, not very, uh... What? Um, okay. You can't specials from the extra deck, all right? So I'm not tripping. Um, yeah, that's cool. I'm going to search for free. I don't care. I don't care about that. Um, oh man, I'm not, I'm not liking it right now. I'm really, I'm really getting pissed off because, ah man, it is when you, you have long duels and then just like literally make one crucial mistake or like going long with this deck does not help. Um, it's not going to get you absolutely nowhere in life by playing. If you go past probably turn 10, you're losing with this deck. There's no way you can survive doing all that. Um, that searches spells, right? No, ritual monster. You're normal summoning that, so either you just you have already you already have the stuff, or you don't. Um, okay, so let's see if he plays around infinite transcience because I put it right here. But most common sense uh, would tell me that most people are just gonna still yes, yeah, yeah, I told you it's gonna get negated. It's gonna get negated. Um, what? Am, am I missing something here? Is this this is not a cost, is it? What the? F I don't even know why I did that because I'm just probably one of the worst players in the history of Yu-Gi-Oh. Um. Okay. That's that's cute. That's that's real fucking cute, isn't it? What do you do? Okay, so that with that being said, we can definitely get over his whole hand. I can discard this to add a layer of darkness. Or I could summon this and go into Thousand Eyes to try to take this. It's gonna negate it. And then I can go into something garbage because that's just how the game goes. Or I can discard this and you know what? Yeah, I think discarding this is the best option. Um, I don't know. I'm really not liking trading in his deck because uh, you really can't do too much with that. So, there's normal summon it. What does this do? Um, these don't do anything. But what I can do is I can just tribute off this. Search either. I don't want full force. Eradicator, Deck Debbie, or this. Because then he's, I'm going to be able to use it with uh i actually should have just picked all three and i knew it i knew it was going to be this i really felt like it was going to be that isn't that just something nice like the fact that you literally did a dumbass move and you get punished for it is something that that's what Yu Gi Oh is all about man this is what Yu Gi Oh is all about you get punished for doing dumb shit i literally could have picked all three of those and trishla fulfills the requirement of all of them of all of them literally every single one of them trish fulfills the requirement of it so for me to do that is just dumb but we're going to get rid of this no need to chain because now um it doesn't matter what he picks i'm going to be able to resolve it should have did that the first time but i'm not great at Yu-Gi-Oh. i'm just slightly good at Yu-Gi-Oh. so yeah he either has to link off or all right we can't link off so that's fine i um, not going to top deck a monster, we're going to top deck another spell, so that's completely fine. Also, just going to activate this, tribute that, kill those threes, alright, so error recurred during transmission. It's this simple, that's this simple Yu-Gi-Oh, that's this simple Yu-Gi-Oh, except for Yu-Gi-Oh Pro. You know, you finally get a hand. You finally get ahead of the game, and then you know you just you just draw in this straight booty like that, man. Just something straight, straight garbage like that, which we're, I guess, used to. I guess we're just used to it. All right, so this hand is very fantastic. We can start off with the um, hmm. We can start off with a monster reborn, actually. So we can start off with a monster reborn, and then we could inst actually we can start off with monster reborn. Right, normal summon this, tribute this, draw a card, special summon a token, special summon that. Yeah, I feel like that's actually really good. Then we can get what's the name back, 
we can just do busted things. Don't tell me. All right, so I was about to say if that was once we're trying, I'm just gonna. Cry. I probably should have just summoned Lilith to be like 1,000, wouldn't you? Um, no, we don't need to do that. Yeah, because why not draw a fucking what's the name just to start the game off? That's cute. Um, Steam token. And so with that being said, we can just go ahead and get this off for free. Um. Then what we can do is we can instant fusion. Go, yeah, let's let's do that. Let's do that. Cause I, I once again messed up play, but it's fine. We have a needle fiber. We can play around it. We definitely need another tuner in here. Another tuner that tributes. I don't know what other does that though. Uh oh, ghost over. Never mind. Um. A better tuner, I mean, you know, you know what I mean? You know what I'm talking about. Um, wait, is this once per turn? Absolutely. Um, you know what's happening now. Clearly, we're going to go Skull Deep. Clearly, we're going to do good things with Skull Deep. Um, oh, there's a Foolish. That's actually pretty good. We can actually put, we can keep this now. One, no, actually one, no, 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 no let's not keep. We should need to, actually, is this a blue card? I'm gonna keep that and I think we're gonna put back instant fusion. I don't feel like we should we shouldn't need that. We shouldn't need instant fusion. So what we can do is special summon this Lilith. Um nope. Then what we can do is use Foolish to send the uh Where are you at? Where are the Destrudo? Then we can um do that special that we can actually keep that because then we can tribute this guy to get eradicator deck devi not eradicator oh yeah eradicator deck devi in full force because now it doesn't matter what he gets what he gives me is deck okay deck devi all right well that that stinks but you know we can roll with it um then we can end our turn we can special something uh what one two and three yeah we did get three so that's cute um i already start off with a lilith and i most likely should have kept a lilith um one two and three <clears throat> one two and three eradicator and then this should tribute special summon and there we go. We we have some. We have a lot of pluses going on. We can deck Devi. There's a Lord of D. Um, absolutely. That's, okay. Well, I was about to say that. That's completely fine. I don't know what he was going for, but he was going to be doing something sweet. Um, yeah. I need to figure out a way to keep going. Skullady. Skullady looks like it's the whole option of this deck. It's like really the whole thing of this deck. All right. So we can get this. Activate layer. Normal summon this. I think there's better fusions. Can use I don't know what I was about to do just now. I was about to do something really stupid. Um and then we can go this. Let's go into an instant fusion. We can instant fusion get out what's the name? Which I feel like it's really good. Instant fusion get out of Theseus. Theseus and that guy goes into a needle fiber. Needle fiber gets me out the young man known as um, Blackwing Steam the Cloak. Then what we can do is just we can't special summon it. Oh wait, I can only summon darts to turn you activated. So then we go Cherubini, I guess. Yeah, we go Cherubini. Get a token for free. Um, use said steam the cloak tribute off of this guy. Did we gonna get a tribute off this guy? Bring him out. Use darkest of Diablos to bring you out. Use Diablo tribute this. Get a free token killer. I mean, not get a free. I mean, get a free token. Yes, but um, also uh, do other things. Um, you know what? You know what would really be good in this deck? That new topologic bomber card, because I could have literally went into that, discarded these two, made him discard two out of his hand. Um, and yeah, we could have, uh, we could have been technically, uh, tied up, because then this would have triggered and got me two cards. 
And yeah, we would have been uh, we'd have been all right. We felt like we'd have been really good in the situation. But let's see what we can do. He's trying to put a card back to either the top or the bottom of his deck. If he picks the top, that means he has a good hand. If he picks the bottom, there's a card he would not rather have in his hand. So, I mean, that's not really dictating if it... But if he does pick the top, that means you have a really entirely good hand. Um, but then you wouldn't pick that card. But then if you do pick that card, that means you have five good cards in your hand. Which is scary for me because when I go into this young man known as... Skoldeed, I'm gonna need to draw Lilith because if I don't draw Lilith, we're just not gonna have a fun time. Um, and I'm pretty sure this is not a quick effect, so we're also not gonna be able to plus off of that. So, yeah, man, what's the time on this one? We're on 10 minutes. All right, so I learned my lesson last time because one time I started a duel after like 10 15 minutes, it ended up being a 30 minute video not going to be doing that today i feel like we should just go ahead and cut it right here because i know you guys don't have time to be sitting around for 40 minutes watching Yu Gi Oh and stuff like that and um i don't think i should have, i don't think i have the time to be sitting around for 40 minutes playing Yu Gi Oh unless i'm playing in the regional which i am not so it looks like this guy is quitting quit quitted so um yeah man i guess that is it for today. Thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys did enjoy the video. If you guys, you know, do like the, you know, the video and stuff like that, go ahead and do the necessary things. Also, if you guys uh, would like to support the channel, um, go ahead and hit one of those links in the description. That'd be enough for me if you want to support the channel. Um, and yeah, that's it for today. Thank you guys for watching. I will see you guys tomorrow with another special, the, the craziest video you're probably going to see. Um, yeah, that's it. I'm um, just going to give you guys one little peek at the deck. Not really as much change since the first one, but yeah. All right, folks. So yeah, here is the deck. Um, like I said, it hasn't really changed. I don't know. Um, I would definitely put more. I would put a lot of different cards in here. Um, I just, I don't, I don't know. There's probably not my play style or something like that. But Lilith is an amazing card. But besides that, yeah, man, you definitely need a whole bunch of different cards. But yeah, thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys did enjoy it. See you guys tomorrow.